All right, I'm gonna show you how to use the drain weasel hair clog tool to remove hair from a drain. Right here is the drain weasel made by a company called Flexi Snake. It spins 360 degrees. Now, if you flip on the back, we're just gonna go over the instructions really quickly before I actually show you how I implement this. Right here, I'm just getting a little bit closer so you can see this. It says, uncoil and straighten snake below the handle as shown. And they're showing it right here. So you're gonna straighten it like this. You're gonna insert the snake into the sink, shower, or tub drain opening. The drain weasel will slide past most drain pop-up stoppers and grates. So this is the drain pop-up stopper, so it should pass around that, okay? So it says place one hand on the sleeve using the other hand, rotate the handle 360 degrees several times to entangle hair. This is what it's showing right here, so 360 degrees, we're gonna do that. It says, pull out snake and debris from drain. Repeat steps two and three and four as needed while reinserting to different depths within the drain. To re reuse, you can actually reuse this. It says, it says, to reuse this, remove hair and clean with stiff brush and sanitize it. So if you want to use this again, it's saying that you can remove the hair get all the, uh, remove the hair, brush it, and then sanitize it, and then you can put it away and use it for later. But we're gonna go ahead and get started with this. So I'm gonna go ahead and open this up, the drain weasel. All right, pull this out like that. Then I'm going to straighten it like it said. So I'm gonna straighten my weasel like this. So it's straightened like that, okay? So now it's saying to insert it down in here. Now it says that it, it can slip past most stoppers, okay? So uh, it can slip past this, but if it cannot, sometimes you can just go ahead and take the stopper like this and spin it off and it comes off and you can go down there. But I'm gonna try to see if it can go down in there with the stopper still attached. So the stopper still attached so I'm gonna take the drain weasel, straightened out like we talked about, and I'm going to insert it down in here. Now it goes down pretty deep, right? So, and I'm spinning it like this, like it says, 360 degrees, and then pull out, it looks like some stuff came out of there. So there's not any hair in this drain, but I'm gonna to try to see if I can go deep. Now I'm going deep, and I'm talking about really deep in here, all like all the way to the, hit the bottom, a bottom out in there, okay? So once it does that, I'm gonna go ahead and spin it. Like it says, it says spin it 360 degrees several times. And then pull it out. And there is some hair, a little bit of hair on there. Now you can go from different angles to try to get down in there. Get in there. I'm gonna bottom out again. I'm going deep inside of the pipe. And then I'm going to spin it like it says. You see I'm holding onto this right here and then I'm spinning it. Yeah, it's pulling out some stuff now. Look at that. Nasty stuff. Look at that. Look at that. Pretty nasty. Now I'm going to go over and I'm going to get over to the bathtub. And I'll try to see if I can get some stuff down in the bathtub. See all that grime and gunk that it pulled out the drain weasel did? So I'm going to go over to the bathtub. And I'm going to get down here and I'm going to do this one as well. So I'm just going to go ahead and sneak past the cover. But you know, for this one, I find it's easier if you can, if it's possible to just remove the stopper. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and straighten this out, straighten my drain weasel out, and then I'm gonna put it down into the pipe and I'm gonna bottom out again. Try to get down as deep as possible, and then I'm just gonna take it, and it's a little bit easier with the bathtub because the drain pipe is a little bit bigger, so I can take my weasel 
and actually do what it says on the pack. All right, so I'm in there spinning it 360 degrees. It showed on the on the package to go this way, but I'm just gonna go ahead 360 degrees like this several times, like it said, and then I'm gonna pull out. Uh, you're pulling out some nasty, there's some hair, not really bad. And I'm gonna go down a different side of the pipe. Still bottoming it out. I try to bottom out, try to get as deep as I possibly can, but it says go at different depths. Now, because my drain weasel has a sufficient amount, I'm able to go at different depths of my choosing. And so I'm in there, trying to bottom out, spin it, come up a little bit, spin it a little bit. And I'm gonna pull my weasel out. Yeah, it's not too dirty in here. So it looks like my drain, the drain is, the pipes are clean. But that's how you use the drain weasel. I hope this was helpful. Thanks a lot for watching.